Hey guys, it's Joanna here. November the 1st is also known as World Vegan Day, a huge event celebrated by vegans from all across the world. Some of you watching this video might be vegan and some of you might not be. I personally am not a vegan. However, I do love to explore the varieties of vegan recipes which are healthy, easy to make and delicious. So, being back in Asia, allow me to share one of my favorite dishes, which I discovered is naturally vegan as well. Oriental stir-fried noodles topped with peanut sauce. This dish is widely eaten across Southeast Asia and it can be served either as a starter or a main course. What I loved about this dish is the variety of fresh vegetables topped with my all-time favorite peanut sauce. So let's start by making the peanut sauce, which to me is what makes this dish. The ingredients you need are 2 tablespoons of peanut butter, 1 tablespoon of soya sauce, 1 garlic clove, minced, 1 small red chili, deseeded and roughly chopped, juice from 1 lime, half a tablespoon of honey or maple syrup, 1 stalk of lemongrass, roughly chopped, a small chunk of ginger, costly chopped, and 3 tablespoons of water. Place all the ingredients into a food processor and process until you get a rather smooth and thin paste. And set the peanut sauce aside. Now let's cook this vibrant and colourful noodle dish. The ingredients I've used are 1 bundle of soba or buckwheat noodles 1 medium carrot 1 large bell pepper thinly sliced 1 zucchini or Japanese cucumber 1 cup of bean sprouts half a red onion chopped into small cubes a handful of chopped parsley 20 grams of peanuts halved half a tablespoon of sesame oil and one small red chili finely chopped cook the soba noodles according to instruction here's a tip to avoid the noodles from sticking drain and rinse with cold water and set it aside Spiralize the Japanese cucumber and carrot into noodles either with a vegetable spiral slicer or a peeler and set it aside. Heat sesame oil over medium-high heat. Toss the peanuts about in the oil until they are slightly toasted on all sides. Then add the onion and chilli and sauté for another 2-3 to three minutes until fragrant. Finally, add the bell pepper, bean sprouts, parsley, carrots, and Japanese cucumber. Sauté very quickly for 2-3 to three minutes and remove from heat. To keep the vegetables crunchy, we do not want to overcook them. Now it's time to assemble this beautiful dish. In a large bowl, take 3 quarter of the mixed vegetables and combine it with the soba noodles. Then separate them evenly into 2 plates. Top it up with the remaining mixed vegetables. And finally, you can choose to serve it with the peanut sauce at the side or drizzle the sauce onto the dish. If you want to pack this out, then choose to pack the peanut sauce separately to keep the veggies fresh and crunchy. This veggie noodles topped with peanut sauce is to die for. Each serving is just under 450 calories. With a huge serving of vegetables and complex carbs from the soba noodles, this meal will keep you satisfied for a very long time. And you're getting 2-3 to three servings of vegetables and healthy fat from the peanut sauce. So this simple dish makes a very healthy meal. You can also choose to serve it without the soba noodles and serve it as a starter. Or replace the soba noodles with another complex carbs of your choice. Vegan or not, try this recipe out and share your creation with me on Facebook and Instagram. All the best! For new fitness, food and motivational videos, please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel and website. Do follow me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter to stay connected with me. Thanks guys!